in some of your videos because yeah. it's pretty it's pretty fascinating when you look at it it's kind of undeniable it, it is and well, what's what's fun about this is too is is that we don't have to guess right? right we know how long it takes we studies have been done about like limestone erosion turns out there's almost an endless number of conveniently dated limestone slabs all around the world they're the tombstones in cemeteries right so you can they get dated they get cut they get inscribed with the date when the when it was put up and then so you can measure it and you can come back over whatever decades and measure erosion and so how long does it take for this face of this limestone erosion to to recede yeah, this is the nutty stuff yeah and because we're assuming that unless something happened to the outside of that that yeah. this was at one point in time flat and smooth yeah 100% because there are still blocks that are protected so a lot of this has been rebuilt this is tricky to see so see you can actually see that the the, the less eroded sections are actually modern restorations because this is so eroded that it's falling apart. Right. And this isn't even the exterior of this structure. This is the interior core masonry. All of this was also, for God knows how many thousands of years, encased in granite. It also points to a trend. It points to a pattern that we, when human beings find ancient things, they do renovations, try to keep them oh, 